What up, YouTube? It's your boy, Life Rude Dude, back with another video today. Hope everybody's doing well. Remember, health is well. Take care of yourself. If you're new to the channel, please make sure you subscribe. Hit that like button for the video. Hit that <laughs> notification so you're notified each and every time we drop a video. I see you want to hop in here now. What's going on, K in real life? Not much. What do you do? Okay, you real mellow, huh? <laughs> I'm All right. hungry. Say what now? I'm hungry. Speaking of being hungry, we taking a delivery of some food. Let me show you. Hello, Fresh. How you doing? Taking delivery of some Hello Fresh. Let's see what we got in the box. Let's open it. All right, ma'am, go ahead and cut that open. Let's see what we got up in here today. Watch your fingers now. What we got up in here? What we got? What we got? Yes. Boom, they gave us some uh, fresh, mm. hello fresh menus. Okay, the usual. Now? Okay, we give them their props. And Can just we... so you know, we are not being endorsed. We're just trying this out, so it's a review. Should we look at these now or later? We can look at those later. Okay. Let's see what the food is like. Again, we're not being endorsed. We would love the endorsement. How at us, hello fresh. Oh, what we got? Okay, it came in a nice um, sealed aluminum type. Refrigerator, okay. Oh, look, we got some Perrier water. Whoa, the Energize. Hold on, what they gave us? Perrier Energize, caffeine, Yerba Mate, grapefruit. Mmm, okay. What else we got in there? Okay, so this one is the Crispy Kicking Cayenne Chicken. Whoa, cutlets. cutlets. Oh, okay. All right, and this one is Turkish spiced chicken and apricot pan sauce. Oh, sound Asian. Okay, gonna be some little stir fry. And don't forget about ingredients, which may oh, be hiding under the ice. So hold on, let's just confirm. So most well, likely we got meats right here, right? No, that is should be everything. So this is what the Turkish. Okay, so this is the actual menu card. Yes. Okay, with the recipe and, and everything, is, with the ingredients. Yeah. So we're gonna have to see which one we're going to do. Okay, man. Mm, mm, mm. Which one do you guys think? Comment below. Let us know. <laughs> All right, so let's see. Hiding under the ice. Oh, this is pretty cold. I just want to touch it. No, I can see. I mean, it pretty fresh. Maybe right? the real gang wanna can y'all can y'all feel how cold it is? <laughs> real gang. All right. Man, two bricks, huh? Throw that in the sink. Okay. Oh, chicken this cutlet. Okay, we got the chicken cutlet right there. This would be some pretty good chicken. Organic, what is it say? Raised without antibiotics. No antibiotic, all right. Okay. Steroid free. That's what it gotta be. What else we got in there? Some more. Oh, okay, uh, that's it. Oh, no, one, one piece of chicken? <laughs> Come on now. Hello, Fresh. What we supposed to do with one? Hopefully it's a pound. Is it a pound? Yeah, hopefully, because uh, both of these have chicken. Uh, this is only 10 ounce. So what's that, just one? Or is that four? Or is it two? We're gonna have to cut it open and see, but it look like it's just 10 ounces. Huh. Hello, oh, Fresh. We okay. need an explanation. <laughs> you sure you looked at everything in the box? That's it. That's it. All right. Let's open this and see. Maybe we got some chicken in there. Hello. Uh, <laughs> we a meal for one. All right. So this one we got some green onions. Got green onions. We got broccoli. We got some packaged broccoli. <laughs> Look fresh. Oh, we got some breadcrumbs, panko breadcrumbs. Okay. Got some cheese. Yep, Monterey Jack. Y'all can what keep is that. This honey. You got the honey. Got sour cream. Got some yogurts. <laughs> Taters. Some potatoes, okay. And some red hot seasoning blend. So that one is obviously for this one. All right, so what the rest of the chicken? Okay, let's open this, because <laughs> uh, I don't wanna. I think we might have some chicken in there. Mm. Maybe some dehydrated chicken? Some powdered chicken? 
Is that really all the chicken? I can hold on because I don't want to mix these two up. So you got to split up 10 ounces between two meals. So that's five. Between two people, 2.5 ounces? That don't sound right. But that's all that's there. They ain't got no chicken in, in this. Wait a second. All right, so far, uh, we're thinking this this can't be right. Well, this is a 10 ounce, 10 ounce, well, so they forgot a whole pack of chicken. Oh, we got to tell them. We got to let them know. All right, so again, y'all saw the unboxing, taking delivery of this. One package of chicken, and it should have came with two. Each one of these meals requires a 10 ounce chicken. We got one 10 ounce chicken. Come on, Hello Fresh, And we promoting you out here. How disappointing is that? Because wow. we got this and this. The authorities will be contacted. Good looking carrots. All right. We got lemon, we got... I mean, where's my protein? Where's the protein? What are we going to do about protein? I mean, we only going to cook one tonight, so... All right, Hello Fresh. I think you guys owe wow. us a whole nother box. We got one... 10 ounce chicken breast. And that's really a one person. <laughs> yeah, that's really one person. Once, you know, you cook it down. That's full of saline, probably. Wow, okay. Hello, Fresh. 100% of our carb emissions are offset, but you give half of the ingredients. Half of the protein. That's not good, man. We done looked in here about five times. Yeah, they ain't hiding nowhere. And as you guys see, we opened this from the very, very jump start. All right, well, we're going to get the cop, uh, we're going to get the chopping up some stuff and get it ready. Wow. Mmm. Hold on, man. Hold on. Hello, Fresh. What you guys doing, man? One 10 ounce chicken for two meals? This little old itty. That little like, bitty y'all chicken. I don't even know how small this is in real life. Well, they can see. But I understand, but I understand that 10 ounce, once it hits the uh, hot pan, it's going to probably cook down to about seven. Six, split between two people. Look at her forehead. She want protein. <laughs> Look at mine. I'm getting there too. Whatever. I right, take that part out. Anyway, man, we about to go ahead and uh, cut up these veggies. Have a whole vegetarian meal, and uh, maybe we got more chicken coming on the way. We're going to stay optimistic. Maybe we got another parcel that's to, pending. I'm about to call them. I don't think we can call them right now, huh? It's kind I don't of, know how late they tell me, but they're going to get a phone call regardless. They're going to get a phone call and they're going to get this video. And matter of fact, Rue Gang, need you guys to go over to HelloFresh and say, hey, look, you guys stiffed Life of Rue dude and came real life of their chicken. Please send them three boxes. We need three more boxes of food. We got ripped off and we're doing a free Complete promo video, boxes, please. doing a free promo video or review, I should say, of this product. <sighs> Let's get to it. <laughs> All right, y'all. So we wanted to go ahead and give you a real look of what, what this chicken looks like. So looking at Karen real life, her hand, this is about a palm worth, a little bit over a palm worth of chicken. For two people. For two people. And this is going to cook down. Look at that. We'll show y'all one when we get it open. Come on, man. Come on, man. Y'all got to do better than this, man. All right, Rue, which one we going to do? Hold on. I'm looking at these ingredients. What did it say? No. <laughs> All right. Based on... <laughs> you want the cayenne chicken cutlet or we going to have the apricot pan sauce and the stuff? We might have to go with these mashed potatoes to keep it full because uh, <laughs> that ain't going to do it with just one thing of chicken that we got to split between two. Either one of them is one thing of chicken. Ten ounce, ten ounce. Understandable, but look, we got... Heavy Potato starch. Potato or you have rice? Heavy starch with the broccoli, which is a slow digesting carb. Okay. But well, we got this, it's you know, carrot. carrots and some, some rice. I think we should go here. All right. I was thinking that too, though. Comment below, guys. Which ones you think going to fill us up? Because we're quite hungry and we only got a little bit of chicken. Mmm. Got, we got some turkey in it. Should we let that defrost? Probably so. All right. So now we got to <laughs> add a whole pound of our own bought food. So we might have to add some more meat to this meal because uh, it came short. Come on, Hello Fresh, I gotta do better than that, man. Come on. All right, uh, 
All right, so HelloFresh, we appreciate you guys throwing in, throwing in this promo Perrier Energized Caffeine Yerba Mate Sparkling Water. I prefer to get the rest of the chicken that was supposed to come with the actual meal, but uh, I guess this will not be accepted as a token of so, substitution. This one says prep time is five minutes, cook time 30 minutes, and 750 calories. We'll see how that goes. And let's see, we got the broccoli, uh -huh. scallion, make sure we got everything we're supposed to have. Broccoli, scallion, sour cream, franks, breadcrumbs, cheese, potatoes, honey, and our chicken. So we got everything for this one. We got everything we need. That's what it looks like. Mm, man. All right, so let me wash hands. And then we get to... What's gonna happen after you wash your hands? Washing the produce. You gotta wash this stuff off. You wanna wash take it? The... You wanna try some of this since we're here? Yeah. Let's go ahead and crack that open. Let me grab a cup over here. Matter of fact, we just share. Yeah. We don't need to dirty up all these glasses. Boom. Oh. All right, y'all, we're about to open up this. All right, we're about to open up this Perrier. Let's see what it tastes like. Energized Perrier water. It's got a cool color. Let us see. Cheers. What you tea? Tastes like a diet water. <laughs> Here, get you some. Tastes like a diet water. Hmm. I really don't like that. I like this. Mm -mm. It tastes like a um. Um. Mm -mm. It's oh, it tastes like oh, uh, uh, what is that? White grape peach, Welch's white grape peach, um, but just not as sweet. But it actually is kind of sweet, so I want to say it's like sugarless or anything like that. But if you have the Welch's white grape peach juice, it tastes like that, even though that's a grapefruit. Mm. Yeah, it's got the caffeine, yerba, mate. Mm. Yeah, I don't, I don't like that one. To be honest with you, I don't like these caffeinated waters anymore. I thought I did, but I, I don't good. like them. I don't like them. Really? No, like this That's one. That's why those been sitting in there for so long? Let me show you. <laughs> oh, tearing up stuff. All right, so I ain't hating on H-E-B, mm. but yeah. This is good. Tried this a couple times, and it's got a good watermelon flavor, but just the car, I'm sorry, cranberry. This one's got the good cranberry flavor, but I just don't like the, the caffeine in the water. It just, I don't know, it made me jittery. I think it's too much caffeine in this. I don't know how much caffeine is in it, to be honest. 55 milligrams. Oh. 55 milligrams. Can y'all see? 55 milligrams. Mm-mm. Don't do it. Or matter of fact, you can do this. Just don't drink coffee throughout the day. Anyway, we need to get this food going. Let's get back to the food. Your break over. Let's go. Let's wash. All right, your break time is over. What you got going on? All right, All right about to so wash, wash the wash produce. produce. Oh, and so the instructions say to position Hold on. the oven. Let me get this out of the way. <laughs> <laughs> uh, to position the oven rack to the top position and to put the oven on 425. I have done that here. Show it's on 120 going to 425. Gotcha. What else we got going? You want me to show them the oven? We told him it's already it's on the way to 425. Oh, it's got to be on the top rack. Yeah. Make sure that you get your oven. Make sure you get your oven to a 425 preheat and put the rack at the very top. Okay. Back over here, ma'am. I have washed the Taters is washed it. Let's see what they say. Okay, trim and thinly slice the scallion. So let's take it out of this little bag and do it. Watch your finger. There you go. And scallions, they need to be washed pretty thoroughly. Cause, um, I never wash my scallions when I cook. 
Yeah, okay, but <laughs> that's, that's a green onion, isn't it? But um, okay, so I don't, I don't watch my green onion. You supposed to watch these? See, this is why you don't need to in the kitchen. But um, cause that dirt gets all inside of and, here, and you would know because you have the garden. Yes, yes, exactly. So I actually wash them before, and then when I slice, I wash after too. Okay, make sure no dirt is in between that. Yeah, man, you could be so much dirt. Got the panko, one fourth of a cup. All right, so. Do you wash broccoli too, or are you gonna leave it as is? I'm gonna wash the broccoli. Okay. All right, so um, we're gonna thinly slice these scallions. I know like professional chefs, they always say like to leave your knife like this and just go, I don't do all that. Okay. What is the difference between a green onion and a scallion? They're the same thing. Okay. They're just different. That's just a formal name or another type of name. So if uh, you go to H-E-B or you go to Kroger's, they got scallions and green onions or it's labeled one? Cause I just see green onions. I don't know. Make a good video. You said what now? <laughs> Don't be you said what now? <laughs> Do us a favor. Rule gang, if y'all know, comment below. Let us know. Do us a favor. Okay. All right. All right, we got scallions going. What else you going for, ma'am? Oh, excuse me, sir. Go I'm ahead. I'm going to put these in here so I can rinse these real quick. Okay. We got to rinse them. Rinse. We don't want no dirt up in our stuff. You know, they put all kind of stuff in the dirt these days. All kind of chemicals and bug killing repellents. Yeah, all that. I don't want none of that. Watch them real good. You're using warm water, cold water? This is cold water. Cold water, okay. But I don't um, know where the strainer is, so we're going to do this uh, straining this way. You know what I'm saying? Gotcha. Pour all that dirt on the uh, chicken, huh? That's right. Yeah. <laughs> all right. <laughs> all right. Chicken's in the package, so it's fine. All right, boom. All right, so now they say, um, oh, okay. Cut the broccoli florets into bite-sized pieces if necessary. No, nah, I think no, we're good. We're good. Yeah, yeah, we're good yeah. with the whole okay. broccoli. Yeah. In a small bowl, combined half the sour cream. Okay, let's see. Let's get a bowl. Get this shower cream. All right. Let's Oh, they say half, so just one. Oh, there's two. So we just gonna use one. Okay, you rinse in a half a teaspoon of the sponge. Okay. One teaspoon. One teaspoon. Excuse me, throw this back in. Refrigerator. We don't need that. Okay, we're gonna do this one. Okay, we're gonna do this one. We don't need that. Edit that. All right, so we pour in the sour cream. Yeah. Sour cream is in there. And it requires only half of what they gave us, right? Yeah, for right now. Gotcha. And then, we're going to a half a teaspoon. We don't do, do, do too much measuring around here, so we're just going to pour what we think is half a teaspoon. I mean, we got a measuring spoon in there, but we'll, we'll do an eyeball. You want eyeball? Yeah. Okay. Four eyes or just two? Uh, about four. About four. Mm, gotcha. Uh, all of them. Pinch of salt. Salt. Boom. All right. Stir in water one teaspoon at a time until measure re reaches a drizzling consistency. Oh, oh, hard. Oh, hard, you want? Oh, yeah. Some good water. Oh, not this. That's a big in there. <laughs> All right, so a little. All right, got some good water right there. Boom. Oh. Just need a drizzle, not a storm. That look like a nice drizzle. My 
for shizzle. The fizzle. Like mayonnaise. What the hell? That look like some mayonnaise. All right, so place a teaspoon, a, a tablespoon of butter. And that's what it said, but my going to say, you know what I'm saying? Okay. We need some they butter. Provide us butter, or they want you to have it. Oh, they ain't give us no butter. Come yeah, on, I'm Hello Fresh. Hello Fresh. Hold on. Hello Fresh. You didn't even give us the butter. We didn't. We got half the chicken we needed, and you you missed giving us the butter. This review is gonna be horrible. Right. Rue game. Make sure y'all get y'all y'all get on they on they uh, website. A tablespoon. That's an extra large tablespoon. No, that's a tablespoon. Put that. Melt it down. Oh wait. Okay. And this uh actually supposed to take five minutes. They said to prepare, right? <laughs> yeah. Five minutes. Shoot, we going on about twenty-two. Oh man. Oh, look at this. <laughs> I need y'all to see what she done did. She didn't cover it. Oh, 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 the oh. The oh and that's the good butter too. That's good butter. Oh right. man. Cover it, please. Okay, in the, on the and in the towel. Wow. Oh. oh, good. No, she wasn't ready. Are you okay? <laughs> Are you okay? You heard your eye? You all right? No, I'm good. All right. I'm going to put that on slow motion. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Where um, we at now? After that, I have to stir in the panko and the Monterey Jack. Okay. And in between that time, oven is at 380, getting to 425. Make sure you use the top rack. We getting this going. All right. So... Start in panko and the Monterey Jack. Remaining Frank seasoning. Ooh, add a pinch of salt and pepper. Ooh. Just do half the cheese, please. Okay. If you don't mind. Alright. Or you can, matter of fact, you can have all the cheese. Give me my portion without cheese. Okay. Cool. Boom. That'll be perfect. They said add in the remaining, so we're gonna have to bring thirty something because it's taking a little while to pour. Past the five minute mark. Yeah, about like 17 minutes. <laughs> All right, add in that, add in that. Then we're supposed to add in Monterey. I do like how this is looking. Let me take a look. Oh, okay. Pinch of salt. And a pinch of pepper. And that's it. Okay. Excuse me, sir. Go ahead and whip it. Mm -hmm. Okay, this is what the chicken gonna be crusted in. Oh, so you don't have to have it there. Okay, that's fine. I'm fast forwarding all this. Yeah, this ain't this ain't got it. I'm about to save some down. What's we going to cut it down? Yeah. All right. So, anyways, um, diced potatoes to a half inch pieces placed in medium pot with enough salt, salted water to cover about two inches. Boil the potatoes. All right, y'all. So make sure you get some water on the side boiling. You will need that for the potatoes that you're about to cut up into inch cubes or something like that. <laughs> um, yeah, just to boil them. They're gonna turn into mashed potatoes, so we just want to make sure it's diced up. This is gonna equal the mashed potatoes, or you can just have you some diced potatoes. Your preference. All right. Excuse me, sir. Okay. Okay. 
24 minutes in. <laughs> so they mean it, they probably mean it takes five minutes to cook after everything has been prepped, right? What happened? We need that. I'm about to cut up these taters. Some pretty good potatoes they put in. Not too oh, bad. And yeah, you got one over here too. Got a little um, Frito pie, dry Frito pie <laughs> going on right there. Got some good onion, AKA scallion. Mmm, smells good. Got the bag broccoli. Looks pretty good. Don't see too much brown. Actually, I don't see any brown. Some good, good broccoli. Good broccoli. All right, got the potatoes in there. They about to get to a boil so we can mash them up. Masher, masher, <laughs> masher. Um, Four twenty-five. All right, y'all. We got the broccoli all prepped on the pan. Got the drizzle with the olive oil on there. What else we got going, babe? Oh, uh, we got this chicken, and we're gonna put this on top. Our little mixture. Now, when you order from Hello Fresh, what'd you say, babe? What did I say when? Saying? When? I don't know, but this is the two serving uh, portion, okay? This is uh, for two people or two servings. So this is two servings that is going to be the equivalent for two people. So you got one little breast, you got that two little breast. I mean, I guess if you're eating in a modest proportion then this is what you should be eating yeah and i guess it's per like calorie count like yeah because it's only 750 calories yeah so that's really splitting it is that per serving i wonder um you know or is that the total it should be per serving right prep time 750 no that's all together so really we're getting huh, 375 per person okay is that all together so that's why these are so small but we still missing chicken for the other one. Mm, well, now I know. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and put this on here. Got that going. Look at that. Mmm. Put that on. This there. gonna taste like. Make sure you get a little more on that one to the right. That one a little more naked. Yeah, I wasn't done, sir. Camera, sir. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> obviously. Excuse me, man. Please talk to me, nice. All right, we got these potatoes. They are boiling. How long we need them to boil for? Uh, they just need to be for tender, so we got okay. to tend to that over there. Again, you need to make sure that your oven is at 425. We're using the top rack. Broccoli on deck. Getting the remaining seasonings on the chicken breast. Throw a little salt on there. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. All right. <laughs> okay. And if y'all want, well, we ain't gonna do that. What? I was gonna say, <laughs> if you bout that life, <laughs> oh, hit him with that hot pepper. Oh, hit him with that hot pepper. Dried brown scorpion, or no, brown chocolate peppers, I believe. One of them brown hot peppers. I didn't, I didn't. All right, let's see. You gotta press this. You gotta press that into it real I, good. I forgot to put the uh, salt and pepper on the other side of it, but. Oh, we got some bland chicken. <laughs> we gonna have bland chicken, ma'am? Hopefully this provides some uh, flavor. We don't want no bland chicken. <laughs> we do not want no raisin cakes chicken. Okay. Oh, 
All right. Boom, 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 boom. Oh yeah. Look, look good. All right. And look at that. Looking pretty darn good. Two servings. One, two. Big broccoli. We're going to throw this in the oven. Mm -hmm. Go ahead and hit it with a little more salt. Okay. Yeah. Put some oil on the broccoli. Hit it with a little um, seasoning too. Okay. A little What's garlic it? seasoning. Garlic Some garlic, the, the garlic pepper seasoning. Oh, this. That'd be a perfect combo if we got any left. This one? Okay, we can, we can try that one. Oh, 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 oh. Boom, garlic pepper. Okay, yep. Pop it. Yep, look at that. Drop all them seasonings, drop your toner. Seasonings. You need all them seasonings. That's good. I think that's good. Okay. Any good. more pepper? I think we're good. Good. Yep. Okay. No spice, no cayenne on no, that? No, we're going to leave it as is. That's okay. what the recipe required. We're going to go strictly by that. Okay. Let's go. I need to drizzle this top with olive oil. No, it's got cheese. That's yeah, cheese. it's got cheese. We're going to help you right here. Oh. Remember, put it at the top. Yeah, use your top rack, folks. All right. And how long are we baking for? That's gonna be for uh, da, 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 fifteen to eighteen minutes. Fifteen to eighteen. Yeah. All right, folks. So that's gonna take between fifteen to eighteen minutes to be completed. We're gonna sit here and get some other stuff taken care of. What you got to say to the people? Let's check on these taters. Check on these taters. Matter of fact, let's check on these taters. So yeah. All right, so taters ain't ready yet, so we're gonna wait. Yeah. So right now, what we got? What we got going right now? We got the chicken going. We got the chicken, taters going. We got the broccoli. We got the taters. After this, once these taters get a little more soft, we're gonna drain off this water. Add a little sour cream. Add a little butter. Add a little salt and pepper. Put a few of these uh, scallions in there, and then those are the taters be done. You know what it sound like we having? What? A baked potato. With chicken. chicken. You put broccoli in a baked potato? I mean, you could. No. Just sound like we have chicken and potatoes and broccoli. Hey, man, to eat your own. <laughs> All right, y'all. So we got the taters now. About to pour a little bit of this water out so we can mash them up. Let's see. Mm. And I didn't peel the skin. I usually like the skin uh, in the potatoes. Do you? Yeah. yeah One sure. question though, do we keep the uh, fire on by, while we mash? Yeah. Okay. Just gotta let the people know. Well, if that's what I do, you might not. I do. Just wanna make sure you're not drying a lot of burning, but you kept extra water in there, so that's great job. Sir. Thank you, thank you. Put a little of these uh, scallions. Yes. And throw all that in there, man. We need it. Well, let's put it on top of this garnish oh, okay. as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See. Sir, thank you, sir. Slather some butter on there, huh? Put some lard on there. That's right. Put some of that good can't old have, lard. Can't have taters without a little lard. Put that lard in there. Watch out with that, can, that blade, though. Taters. could, but they wouldn't be taters. What would you call it? Just, what would you call it? Just a boiled potato. A boiled potato. What's a boy, but how you spell that? <laughs> they say put this pack in there. That's what this other pack was for. Excuse me, sir. You just throw that right there. Thank you. My shit. My shit. My shit. Mmm, that looks good. Can you throw a little milk in there, too? Throw some milk. I still kept some of that water over there. The potato water. No, we don't want no potato water. We want some real milk. Milk? Okay. Go and get some milk. Turn this down a little. That milk will make them fluffy. Now, see the All right, we got this milk. Hit you with that top. Boom. Oh. How much should we pour in there? I trust your, your measurements. Boom. Oh, let's see what that do first. Mmm. Mmm. Make it, make it 
creamy. Excuse me. Need a little more, we good. Uh, I believe we're probably good at this point. Just need some uh, saltcher. Oh, <gasps> this was open on the wrong side. Oh man, she done threw the whole C in there. No, move. She threw the whole sea salt in there. She threw the, wait a minute. Dude, did you open it on that side? Why would I do that? Why would I, I want to know. ruin it? Did you? The food, no, that wasn't me. That was a user error. Uh-uh, I didn't even Cooking open it. error. All right, I think we're good. I think we're good. I you think fished we're it good. out? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look at that, look at that. I think we're good. Wow. Wowzers, wowzers, wowzers. Temperature down. We got about three minutes left on that good old broccoli. They definitely don't give chicken. you enough to have leftovers. Nah, this is 750. That's it. That's it. That's one day, one meal. One person. Or two. Two missions. Let me, uh, <laughs> I mean, but this that's, is that's two regular cool. sized meals. I mean, this is just supposed yeah. to be a dinner. Yeah, and it's th that's why a you light have dinner. To and that's why you have the option of getting, you know, a meal delivered every day or, you know, I mean, one more meals in your pack. Here, let's taste this. What did it taste like? Mmm. Pretty good. Pretty damn salty. But I mean, oh, it's good. No, it's good. I'm, I'm joking. <laughs> I'm gonna say because my, uh, my, my spoon. I need a little more black pepper. Uh, needs a little bit more black pepper. But I'll put that extra on mine. I'll put that on my plate when we serve. All right. But at least it's not salty. No, it's good. Great job. You're doing a great job over here, chef. <laughs> Thank you, little camera person. <laughs> <laughs> you, uh... So that's good, they don't need no more milk or no nah, more? No, I think we're fine right there. We don't want it too, too liquidy. Yeah, that's perfect. That's I love having the potato skins in there. Yeah, it makes it real wholesome looking. Yeah. Mmm, hearty. Mmm. Mm. All you need is some chicken fried chicken to go with that with Damn. some gravy and a couple biscuits. Damn, for real. Why you ain't made no biscuits? Why you ain't made no biscuits? Man, guess who we got to blame? Hello, Fresh. For not including the biscuits. No, I didn't come with biscuits. Man. All right, y'all. So we're going to wait for this chicken. Actually, we should be taking this out shortly. Yeah, so look. This is what we put together. Not me, but can real life. We got Both of us. Please stop doing that. Look at that. We got some good old mashed potatoes. Got these good old scallions. that we're going to go ahead and sprinkle the remaining remnants onto this chicken. <laughs> Follow me over here. We're still blaming Hello Fresh. Missing chicken, best believe, Rue Gang. Y'all go to HelloFresh.com, say Life of Rue Dude and Came Real Life ordered. I'm gonna put in the description what box option this is. Y'all let them know we're missing 10 ounces of chicken at least. We need that. And this right here. That was good. No. That is so great. Ooh, yes. This, this does not, that don't take away the fact that y'all missed this chicken. But I do appreciate this promo drink because it's really, really good. Mm. Y'all could have threw extra water in there for me. <laughs> I would have been happy. Mm -hmm. Put this milk up. How many minutes we got on this? Oh, seconds. seconds. Oh, yes. I'm so hungry, I'm eating onion. <laughs> Should we stop it now? Twenty-seven seconds. We're gonna plate everything and show you the results. All right, y'all. So this is what we got so far. We think it. We think it might be done. They said fifteen to eighteen minutes. It's been fifteen minutes. Broccoli look like it might be done, but we want to test this chicken. Let's just make sure. Some people like theirs super juicy. Which one you want? Uh, I don't matter. I'll take the one in the back. All right. You can put your hands on that one. <laughs> All right. Let's check and see from the center. Of course. Yeah. Let's make sure. Oh, 
I'll cut the whole thing through. You want that? I like to make sure mine's done all the way through. Okay, that look pretty done. I don't want to see no pink. I want nothing but white striations. Right okay, yep. Okay. Mm. All right, y'all, we're going to plate this. Excuse me. We're going to plate this. See y'all in a minute. All right, y'all, here goes the finished product. Boom. We got the spicy panko chicken with the drizzle. Boom. Potatoes and the actual broccoli. Spicy panko without the drizzle. Potatoes, broccoli. Wonderful dish. Can I get a high five? Boom. We about to go ahead and tear this up. And we're going to holler back at y'all in a few. All right, y'all. So we just finished this fabulous meal from HelloFresh. Now, we doubted the portion size. We are still missing the chicken, right? We still missing that yeah, other 10 ounces. Chicken, yeah. But we did, well, myself, I know I made some comments saying, hey, look, this don't look like it's gonna fill us up. But with the potatoes, the chicken, and the broccoli, full. It was good. I gave it a 10 out of 10. What'd you give it? I'm gonna give it a seven. Oh, okay. I would've gave him a 10 had we had all our ingredients. But since we missing ingredients, I can't give you a 100% rating. Even talking about this particular meal, this plate of food. <clears throat> okay. All right, all right, all right. So to be fair, when it comes to the meal, since we had everything for this one meal, I guess we could. Oh, we were missing butter. No, but actually, they say that you should have these basic items in your home. I just I saw that, like okay. oil, salt, and pepper, butter. It's like on the website. Okay. So well, based on that, I give it a nine and a half. Okay. I give it a nine and a half. It was a good meal. It was light but filling. And it wasn't like super cheesy because I know you don't really like cheese, but it was like the panko with the cheese. Mm -hmm. So it was mostly the panko and the seasoning that you tasted, but it was really good. Very good. And the portion size was perfect because I'm so full and you're full, right? Full to the max. Yeah. We were just looking for that like American, you know, too much food. No, what they provided was actually... Plenty. Looking for leftovers, but they don't provide leftovers with this, which we understand because this is what we ordered, yeah. right? Yep. And um, they probably don't even really want you to have leftovers. They want you to like just order more food from them. So I mean, I get that. So. So we give you. I give you a nine and a half. I gave that plate of food a ten. It was. It was really. It was. It was surprising. Though. Right. Real gang, we still need you guys to go in the comments. Let us know what you think. Also, go to HelloFresh.com and let them know you shorted Life of Rude Dude and K in Real Life 10-ounce chicken. We need that chicken within the next seven days. Free packages or something, but we want that. Being 100% honest here, we want that chicken. And we didn't show, but the drizzle on top was um, a honey... A honey and then a sour cream type drizzle with some seasoning and stuff. It was really good. It helped to help balance it too. Gotcha, gotcha. Mm -hmm. That's all I really got to say, man. I'm full. Yeah. So until next time. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. Follow me on Instagram, Life of Real Dude. Motivated Millionaire LLC. What you got to say? Um, health is wealth. Take care of yourself. Going to a million. <laughs>